Hey guys, welcome back to Wixfix. I hope you're having a fantastic day. In today's quick little video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add an Instagram feed to your Wix website. Let's go ahead and get started. So on your Wix website, what you can do is come over to the app marketplace and in the little search bar, we can go ahead and search for Instagram. And you're going to see this one called Instagram feed right here. If you click on that, you're going to see it's also made by Wix. This will help you verify which one that we're going to be using for this video. And we can just press add to site. Now it's going to add this little feed feature right here. That looks something like this. What we can do is go into the settings. We can go down to display. We can hide the profile because we, maybe we just want the images and we can go ahead and disable hashtag feed because maybe we don't want that. Down below display is settings. Here we can say it's in English. We can have the images expand on to a full screen version when it's clicked on. We can enable hover on post and we can choose which direction that the app is displaying your images. I suggest left to right because typically your newest post will be over here on the left and you don't want to display your older ones first. So I suggest going left to right and that is also more in line with your actual Instagram feed itself. So I highly suggest you keep it just left to right. Below settings is text. And here, if you have hashtag showing, you can say show hashtags or no title. For the load more button, you can choose what the load more button says. Under text is links, so you can actually control where these posts link out to. Below that is layouts. You know, we've already hidden our profile and our hashtag feed, but if you want to go turn those on, you can go into those settings. But if we go into the settings for your post, we can actually choose the layout on which they display. So we can have it be a grid, a slider, which is what we're going to be using today. Or you can even do a collage if you want, which I also really like this one as well. But we're going to do slider for now. And we can also control how many posts are displaying at one time. So maybe we want six to display. We can choose the spacing in between each of these posts and we can change the gallery padding if we want as well, which for now, I'm just going to remove that. And we can also enable endless scroll if we want to. Now this should get rid of the load more button if you have that on the grid layout, but we're just going to go ahead and enable that for us real quick as well. And then below layout is the design. So here we can actually choose, you know, the, the text fonts and colors, the button styling, the background, which we don't really want a background here. So I'm just going to remove that. And we can also control some of the settings for the expand mode when the user clicks on the image itself. So we can have the caption, the comments, everything like that. And we can change the fonts and colors as well. But once you're done with the settings, we can leave this just like this, or we can even press stretch and make it stretch the full width of the screen just like that. And I think this looks really cool for this specific section. And in order to get your Instagram feed on your website, if we go back into the settings and go to the main tab, here we can actually connect a business account or connect a personal account. Now, if you're a business, you can just go ahead and do that. Or if you never set up your Instagram account as a business account, then it's going to be by default a personal account. So just say connect personal account. And when you click this, it's pretty easy. All you really have to do is press that and it's just going to open up something that looks like this and it will allow you to sign in and just press allow. And then all of your most recent photos from your Instagram will appear here. That basically wraps it up for the video today. If you guys did enjoy, please consider giving this video a like and consider subscribing for more Wix content coming out really soon. Thank you all again, and I'll see you on the next one.